the European Organization for Nuclear Research, known as CERN, derived from the name Conceal European Paul La Recherche Nucléaire, is a European research organization that operates the largest particle physics laboratory in the world. Established in 1954, the organization is based in a northwest suburb of Geneva on the Franco-Swiss border and has 23 member states. Israel is the only non-European country granted full membership. CERN is an official United Nations observer. CERN's main function is to provide the particle accelerators and other infrastructure needed for high-energy physics research, as a result, numerous experiments have been constructed at CERN through international collaborations. CERN is the site of the Large Hadron Collider, the world's largest and highest energy particle collider. The main site at Myron hosts a large computing facility, which is primarily used to store and analyze data from experiments, as well as simulate events. Researchers need remote access to these facilities, so the lab has historically been a major wide area network hub. CERN is also the birthplace of the World Wide Web. The World Wide Web began as a CERN project named Inquire, initiated by Tim Berners-Lee in 1989 and Robert Cayo in 1990. Berners-Lee and Cayo were jointly honored by the Association for Computing Machinery in 1995 for their contributions to the development of the World Wide Web. Based on the concept of hypertext, the project was intended to facilitate the sharing of information between researchers. The first website was activated in 1991. On 30 April 1993, CERN announced that the World Wide Web would be free to anyone. Many activities at CERN currently involve operating the Large Hadron Collider and the experiments for it. Eight experiments are located along the collider, each of them studies particle collisions from a different aspect and with different technologies. Construction for these experiments required an extraordinary engineering effort. For example, a special crane was rented from Belgium to lower pieces of the CMS detector into its cavern, since each piece weighed nearly 2,000 tons. The first of the approximately 5,000 magnets necessary for construction was lowered down a special shaft at 13.00 GMT on 7 March 2005. People from all over the world work together harmoniously at CERN, representing all regions, religions and cultures. CERN exists to understand the mystery of nature for the benefit of humankind. Scientists at CERN use the world's largest and most complex scientific instruments to study the basic constituents of matter, the fundamental particles. Particles are made to collide together at close to the speed of light. This process gives the physicists clues about how the particles interact, and provides insights into the fundamental laws of nature. CERN will not open a door to another dimension. If the experiments conducted at the LHC demonstrate the existence of certain particles it could help physicists to test various theories about nature and our universe, such as the presence of extra dimensions. The magnets at CERN have an electromagnetic field, which is contained with the magnets themselves and therefore cannot influence the Earth's magnetic field, nor the weather. The strength of the LHC magnets, 8.36 teslas is comparable to the magnetic field found in PET MRI scanners, up to 9.4 tesla, which are regularly used for brain scans. The LHC will not generate black holes in the cosmological sense. However, some theories suggest that the formation of tiny, quantum, black holes may be possible. The observation of such an event would be thrilling in terms of our understanding of the universe, and would be perfectly safe. Does the LHC trigger earthquakes? The LHC does not trigger earthquakes. Earthquakes are a natural hazard caused by the movement of tectonic plates. As these rigid plates move towards, apart or past each other they can lock up and build up huge stresses at their boundaries, such as the middle of the Atlantic Ocean, or along the Pacific Rim. When the plates suddenly slip apart, this stress is relieved, releasing huge amounts of energy and causing an earthquake. Several million earthquakes occur across the Earth each year, but most are too small to be detected without monitoring equipment. There is no means by which the LHC could trigger earthquakes, and no correlation between LHC operation and the occurrence of earthquakes. Some high-precision instruments at CERN are able to detect earthquakes due to their sensitivity to tiny movements. In the LHC, there are more than 100 hydrostatic leveling sensors that monitor the relative displacements of the magnets that steer beams of particles around the LHC's 27 km ring. What is CERN's mission? 
unite people from all over the world to push the frontiers of science and technology for the benefit of all.